Hello guys and welcome back to British Gaming today. Today we're doing um oh my god, we're doing an English opening. This is not um something we uh, ever do really. We don't really open English stuff anymore. In my last video when we did this thing, the big SM10 set, I did promise we'd be doing some generations. Yay! I think this is like three years old now, the generation stuff. 2016 is it? Yes. 2016. Three years. I'm not sure if it's quite three years just yet. So I thought we'd do a few boxes. Uh, I've got some boxes I just I just need to open. Um, they didn't sort of hold the value as I had hoped. I thought they would be like worth hundreds by now, but they're worth uh, almost nothing. I think a lot of people had the same idea. Hence why I've been left with uh, uh, <laughs> a few boxes. I stopped at... Um, I stopped at Darkrai. I thought, nah, is it gonna work? So yeah, I've got three Mew boxes, but yeah. So um, yeah, you get the, th these are good sets. You get two, two booster packs, um, the generations, you get the, the promo card, and you get the pin as well. So there's, a, there's plenty of reasons to sort of buy these sets at a time. I think um, uh, it's time to open them up because there are some really cool cards in here. And I think the poor it's were, oh, were quite good. So let's just open these up. I'm not gonna take too long. I should have done this before. This is where the word preparation and British gaming once again don't come in the same sentence. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna take the packs out, guys. So we got six boxes, which means we get uh, 12 packs. Oh no, I don't even know where all this stuff's gonna go. Quite a relaxed video. There are there are there are dogs around. If we just have a quick look down here. There's a little Maggie, she's just chilling, okay? You come to enjoy the show? Yeah, so she's down there. Uh, Rudy's about somewhere, I don't know, but he's, he's somewhere. Um, two packs, Charizard looks great with that Charizard, doesn't it? Um, I couldn't even tell you what's actually in <laughs> inside this set. I know there's some really cool full art cards. I think, is this is this the one with the, with the Radiant collection in it as well? So the booster pack's kind of in, Wow, this this glue has solidified over the years. Yeah, let's just just rip it open. <laughs> it's worth the exact same amount as it was when I bought it. Excellent. <laughs> so we'll get some content out of it, out of it, and hopefully we'll get some good cards out of it as well. Would be nice, wouldn't it? So let's just uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're a third of the way there, guys. Let's try and speed things up a bit. Um, so you could, I guess, now that I'm uploading again, describe my upload schedule as consistent. Oh god. These are, these are not made to get into. I think it's trying to tell me something. Don't open those boxes. We're gonna make them very difficult to get into. Right, there's another two. Okay guys, we're halfway. <laughs> so the SM10, if you haven't seen it, the big set, where I got two booster boxes, this this one here. Um, I got one of the greatest pulls since Tag Team began. Uh, the Full Art uh, Red and Red Challenge. And it was it was a amazing pull, really happy to do that. Finally get a good Tag Team pull. I'm sorry this is taking so long. We're, we're nearly four minutes in and we've not done anything. I hope you just enjoy me rambling on for a minute. Um, normally with the Japanese boxes, I know what I'm doing. At least we can read the names out this time, so we shouldn't get anything wrong, apart from a few uh, pronunciations, I'd imagine. Nearly there. Nearly there. <laughs> uh, planning. Oh, I've lost my dark ride pin. Right. Okay. 10 packs, <laughs> nearly there guys, <laughs> don't switch off, don't switch off just yet. Uh. So we have 12 packs, which is a third of a booster box really, you couldn't get these in anything apart from these, these sets, they did this for uh, an entire year. So I, I only have four here, right, excellent, excellent. Excellent, we're happy, we're happy with this now. We've got two Charizards, a Venusaur, Blastoise, Charizard, 
Blastoise, Pikachu, Blastoise, Blastoise, Charizard, Charizard, Blastoise. Okay, one Pikachu. Okay, and one Venusaur as well. Okay, obviously the most popular ones are here. Uh, Blastoise and Charizard. So, I don't know, have any idea how this is going to go. Generations. You get code cards? No code cards in the Generations pack. I don't know the trick. Have I ever done the trick? No is the answer. I've never done the trick. So here's Magikarp. Here's a Steel Energy. A Pikachu. A Clefairy. Uh, a reverse is a, a Hitmonchan. Nice. And we start with a, hey, a Gardevoir EX. What a start that is. And obviously you've got Ralts and uh, Curlia in the artwork as well. So as I said, like the pull rates are really good out of the, um, out of the uh, uh, Generations packs. I think you can actually get uh, more than one full art in a pack. So there's another Hitmonchan. So we'll put uh, Gardevoir there. First pack's gone well. Uh, Gulpin, um, that must be, that must be a Comia Gulpin, it is indeed. Uh, Pokemon Fan Club, uh, Shauna, and that is pack one. Hey, we've got a hit out of pack one. That is good going for a start. Um, what did I even open? Was it Blastoise? Yeah. I will just go across, across the board, guys. These packs are really thick. They just seem so much thicker than the, uh, uh, Japanese ones, probably because they got twice as many cards in. Krabby, Geodude, uh, Raihorn Reverse, and a the Dene is a hollow card, and it's really cool. It's got like the uh, sleepy pattern, which is hollow as well with the, with the Zeds, so that's quite cool. Whoa, and a Nine Tails uh, EX. I gotta keep saying, <laughs> remind myself it's EX and not GX. We are a few years behind, so we did get another pull, a Nine Tails EX. Excellent, another uh, Gulpin Persian. And a Pokeball. Excellent. So, <laughs> two packs, two hits. I did say the hit, the pull rate is actually quite handy. Quite good indeed. And you can get the, I think you can get the pull from um, the Radiant collection side of the pack and the Generation side of the pack. Yeah. Oh, I'm probably not explaining that very well. <laughs> it's Pikachu. Um, for instance, Pikachu here has got the uh, generation set number and set symbol there. A Radiant Collection, which is after the rare in the pack, says uh, RC there. So can you quite see that? It's slightly different, the focus isn't that great, but it says RC there, which means it's part of the Radiant Collection instead. Fairy Energy, can we make it three from three? Zubat, Magma, Reverse is a Doduo. Fair enough. And then an Altaria with the uh, fancy hollow pattern and the Sylveon and a Dedene there as well. And then a Hitmonlee, so we didn't we didn't quite uh, strike anything as good as the last two packs maybe. Max Revive there. But uh, you know, not bad, not bad. I think you do you always get a hollow at least from the, gener uh, from the Radiant Collection. I don't know. It was three years ago guys, I wasn't even, I wasn't even there wasn't even a channel back then. Ghastly. Meowth. Slowpoke. Tangela. The Reverse. Magikarp. Yes! And then a Wally holo card from the Radiant Collection. And then a, a Jinx there. We'll just put Wally over there. Jinx. Uh, Floral Crown. Clefable. And a uh, Machoke there. So yeah, we've got that holo again. I think, I think, I think the holo at least is... Um, well, we're guaranteed. It was a really good set, actually. Really good packs. Fun packs to open. Uh, Magma, Ghastly, Fire Energy, Tangela, Reverse is a Paris, and then we have a Slurpuff Hollow, and then a oh, and then a Butterfree Hollow as well, um, which is very interesting. So uh, great to get that and that too. Uh, what else we have? A Snow Run, a Clement, and a Metapod. Let's put these, I'm just going to pile them up here. We can look through them at the end, you know. We're moving on to the Charizard packs now. In the hunt for a Charizard. Is it, was the Mega Charizard in this? Mega Charizard EX? I don't know. I hope we get to see one of the really cool full art cards. And I'm not sure if you class that Gardevoir as one of the full art cards. A Water Energy? Did we start with an Energy? I can't remember. Ghastly. Krabby. A fire energy, two energies. Oh, fine. Just give me, just give me two uh, super rares. Would be great. Clement, 
and to Denny, and then the Mega Charizard EX. That is one of the cars, uh, uh, you know, one of the better cars from the set, definitely. So that's, uh, I can't remember if that's X or Y, but it's definitely the Dragon Fire Charizard. Um, so yay, excellent. Literally what I was just talking about, the Mega Charizard EX part of the set. Not a full art card, but definitely like um, one of the much better cards to pull. Indeed, doubled up into Dene there. So two energies in a pack, and then one of the best EX cards in the pack. Out of the Charizard pack as well. So we're doing well with our Charizards uh, lately. Especially after we finally got the Tag Team GX out of SM10. There's Rhyhorn here, Ponyta, Magikarp, Leaf Energy, reverses it, a Caterpie, and then we have a, another God of War EX, doubled up on the God of War, yes, and a Charizard EX as well. Oh, this is going very well. I see what I mean, you can get two hits in one pack, which is great. That's excellent. So we got two God of Wars. We got Charizard and then it's Evolution Mega Charizard. So can we balance that there, Charizard? And then we've got our three cards to finish off uh, there. Moving on. One, two, three, four, five. So we've just gone over the halfway point, guys. Um, going very well so far. Still no um, full art card as such. I think I think there's definitely Zapdos, Articuno. Uh, Pikachu is another one I can think of. I can't remember them all, you know. Meowth, Magma as Pikachu, Darkness Energy, Hitmonlee Reverse, and then a Diancy with a Radiant Collection Hollow, then a Rapidash, so nothing uh, there. And we have our other three cards, including Imakuni, who I think everyone really loves Imakuni. He's so crazy. Four packs left to go, guys. Two boxes worth. I hope um, you guys are enjoying the sort of generations. See? It's, uh, it's, it's not all Japanese on the channel, it's, it's just 99.9%. Machop, uh, Fighting Energy, Meowth, oh, a Reverse is a Psychic Energy, it's kind of nice. And then we're in with the, another, <laughs> the playset is near. <laughs> another Gardevoir EX, and then a, uh, a Raichu Hollow card there. Charmeleon, uh, Cloister, and Haunter. That reminds me, there's a really nice uh, Charizard holo card um, somewhere. But there's Raichu, put him there. Um, I think this is really nice actually, the reverse Psychic Energy. Maybe, maybe we keep that to one side. Can we get that God of War e e EX playset? Is it, is it four cards for an EX playset? I don't know. Okay guys, come on. The pull rates are really good, I can't complain. This is going very well. Rhyhorn, Bonita. Magikarp, Leaf Energy, Hitmonchan, and a Floet, the Radiant Collection Hollow, and a Taurus. So nothing uh, in that one there. Uh, last two packs. We only had one pack of Venusaur and one pack of Pikachu in, the, in all, all 12 packs. So maybe they'll be lucky, maybe not. We're going to find out. It's gone well, the opening, I have to say. Uh, Shelda. Caterpie, Doduo, uh, Water Energy, reverses a Clement. Then we have a Yveltal Holo card from the Radiant Collection. The patterns on the, the card are really nice. You can just catch that there with the light. Then we have a, a Hitmonchan. So nothing in that pack there. It's not often we go two packs in a row without getting like a really good pull or a decent pull. So we're in with the last pack, the Pikachu pack. Pika pack, if you like. We are about to wrap up this opening. So let's do it. We have Caterpie, Machop, a Lightning Energy, Shelda, reverses another Caterpie, and to finish off our Radiant Collection, we have our Jirachi Holo card, which is nice. I like the, the pattern again. And then finally, we have a, a Parasect, so nothing in the last few packs there, really. We used to have all our luck really early, uh, uh, really early on. Um, we've got the Denes, as you can see there, the Jirachis here. Yveltal, Loet, Raichu Hollow, Diancie, uh, Slurpuff, Butterfree, Wally, and Altaria. We've got the Ninetales EX. We managed to get three, three Gardevoir EXs. Incredible. Um, that's a really nice card, actually, so I'm quite happy to get three of those. We have the Mega Charizard EX and Charizard EX. 
So that is it, an English opening and a, quite an old one at that. So I hope you enjoyed looking back on these old X and Y cards and the generations. Um, yeah, definitely uh, takes me back to when I, I think it's when I started collecting again was around this time. So yeah, it's been fun to do that and I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. We have SM10A coming up on the channel. We have some PSA returns coming up on the channel. So don't miss out, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you again very soon.